Hey everybody, um, my name is Alyssa. Um, I work at PCC Markets um, and I have a presentation as well to show if I could share my screen. Yes. Jonathan, Great. can Alyssa more? Thank you. Did it work? Yep. Awesome. All right. Okay. Um, so to start off, what is PCC? I'm not, um, a lot of you might not be familiar or might be familiar because there's one in your neighborhood. Um, PCC is a grocery store. Um, we're local to the Puget Sound um, and we are a co-op model. So that means that our members make decisions of what we sell in our stores as well as um, uh, make decisions on who our leadership and board teams are. Um, and we also have a, a huge focus on local and organic um, food as well. Um, so for PCC locations, we have quite a few locations. Um, we have everything from down south from Burien, West Seattle, um, Columbia City, and we just opened a store um, near the Central District. Um, we also have stores on the east side, up north in Bothell and Edmonds, um, all throughout North Seattle, and then um, we're going to be opening Bellevue later this year, um, and then opening a downtown Seattle location next year as well. Um, so for a majority of you, the closest stores would probably be Burien, um, West Seattle, Columbia City, or the Central District. Um, and then hopefully um, next year, the downtown Seattle location. Um, so we have all kinds of um, positions available um, in grocery, produce, and front end. Um, so front end would be like cashiering, um, a person in charge, which would be managing the front end. Um, for high schoolers, we do have a position called courtesy clerk. Um, so you could be 16 or older to apply for that. Um, and what that would look like, it's a really good first job. You would be bagging groceries, helping customers to their car, right now focusing on a lot of sanit sanitization. So like wiping down carts and baskets, um, taking out the trash and cleaning when needed. Um, so for high schoolers, we do offer that part-time. So, um, and we hire a lot of high schoolers who can start after their um, school shift and then work on the weekends as well. We also have a deli, which is a huge part of our um, operations. Um, so for those positions, you have to be 18 or older, um, but that would be working the counter case, um, serving food, working in the taco bar, the pizza bar, the grain bowl bar, um, making coffee. There's a lot of different opportunities in the deli, um, as well as cooking and dishwashing um, and management as well. So these pictures are of um, actual PCC staff. Um, we also offer a lot of really great benefits. Um, so if you're full time, which is 32 to 40 hours a week, we offer medical, dental, and vision benefits after 60 days. We are in the union. Um, we have paid vacation and sick time, a 15% staff discount, a free membership in the co-op, um, reduced rate on ORCA cards. So it's only $13 a month for an unlimited ORCA card, so bus pass. Um, retirement plans and then free PCC cooking classes as well. Um, right now during COVID, the classes are all online, um, but when you do, when those get back to normal, you could attend any of them free at any location. And we have all kinds of classes like, you know, pizza making, um, Persian food, Japanese ramen, um, Chinese dumpling making. We have a lot of different classes. I've taken several. Um, so for our culture and values, um, we are committed to fostering, cultivating, and preserving a culture of diversity and inc inclusion. Um, so this is a message that's on our website. Um, but what we do is um, with every store that we open in a new community, we try our best to hire 50% from the community. Um, we are also implementing a diversity training for all of our new stores that we're gonna put in our current stores as well. Um, and then in terms of actions we're taking to prevent the spread of um, COVID, all staff and customers are required to wear masks. If you don't have a mask, we will provide you one at the store. Um, we have plexiglass installed at every register. Um, we are also hiring clean team courtesy clerks for sanitization. So if you are 16, this is a good position um, to apply for. It'll be titled courtesy clerk slash clean team. Um, we are social distancing in the store, so at the registers will have um, different kind of like place marks so you're spread apart from everybody. Um, and then washing your hands frequently and then staying home when sick as well. So for how to apply, if you could go to our website, pccmarkets.com and then go to about slash jobs, 
um, you'll see a list of all of our open positions. So we have pretty much open positions in every store that we have, um, and you could filter it out by the store. So if you're interested in the Columbia City store, just filter it out by Columbia City, and then you'll see all the open positions on the website that are available at Columbia City. Um, if you have any questions, please um, email me. There's my email address. Um, if you have any questions about how to submit the application, um, I will say you'll have a highly like um, a higher likelihood of getting a call back if you fill everything out. So we really want to see your work experience and availability. That's really important to us. Um, so for um, interview tips. Um, we ask a lot of customer service questions. So because every job in the store requires some level of customer service. So I'll ask something or, like, or along the lines of describe a time when you gave good customer service. Um, we definitely check availability. And this is something that's really important on the application. Um, put your, not only your desired availability, but what um, hours you're able, just able to work. Um, because we're retailers, so weekend availability is really important for us, and we know that a lot of um, high schoolers are able to do that, so that'd be great, and we'll definitely ask about that in the interview as well. Um, we ask about um, past work experience. Um, so how does your past work experience relate to this job? So if you've worked um, you know, in, a grocery, in another grocery store, if you've worked at a mall, um, all of those experiences can relate to working in a grocery store, um, especially if you like food and um, like love food or you've worked with food before. Um, and then another really important one that um, I give feedback for in interviews is to not speak poorly about past employers. Um, that is just something that I think is a, just a good tip in general um, that we also look out for. Two minutes to questions. And okay. then um, one, one person has asked if you could show your email one more time. I think oh, yeah. I'm trying to write it down. Um, it's alyssa.more at pccmarkets.com. So the dot com is hidden by, well, on my computer, it's hidden by our photos, but there is a uh, dot yeah. com at the end for um, mm -hmm. the person writing it down. Great. Okay. Um, this is not super relevant for everybody here, but if you do know anybody that lives near Bellevue, we're hiring for Bellevue right now and hosting social distancing job fairs. Um, and then to finish, I have our quick recruiting video that I thought would be um, good to share. Can you hear it? No. All right, um, and then that's all I have for you. All right, well, we have some questions for you. Great. Oh, thank you, Jonathan. Um, I want to go back. Um, what times do we have if we are working there? So they're asking about a typical schedule. So maybe if you could do a typical sp schedule for a uh, part-time and a yeah. full-time. Yeah, definitely. So um, full time, um, typically we do look for open availability, but an AM shift could be as early as maybe, um, depending on what it is, it could be as early as six or seven. Um, and we do eight hour shifts. Um, we also have mid shifts that can start around one o'clock or so. Um, and then a closing shift would be maybe around for starting at three um, or four. And then depending on which store it is and how late it's open could go until um, 10 to midnight. Um, for part time, um, for high schoolers, we do offer like four hour shifts um, as soon as they get out of school. So that maybe that would be like four to eight. Um, and then during the summer, they're able to work um, full time throughout the summer as well. And um, I do want to add, Justin put on a fabulous reminder there that um, all the information from all the providers, including their, their emails and their phone numbers that they've given us, will be the, that information you can pull down, download from the Zoom, or you can come and get a copy in person at the log cabin. So I know many of you are trying to write it down very quickly, and we totally understand. Mm -hmm. And so um, that, that will be downloadable, and then you can come down and get a copy. And then Alyssa, there was a couple more questions. If you mm -hmm. can tell us again how to apply, I think. Yeah, um, just go on our website, pccmarkets.com slash about slash jobs, and then all of our open positions are there. 
and then you could fill out the application that way. And then do you have the overnight shift stocking? The late um, mm -hmm. Yeah, so a late night stocking job. So if you're looking for overnight, like a graveyard shift, we do have those and those will be titled um, overnight um, grocery helper clerk or overnight night crew clerk. We also have deli positions. So overnight dishwashing or overnight um, deli helper clerk. And then you had another, um, I believe you told us that you can write in the store that you're specifically looking for job openings. Did you start with that? Because um, um, this amazing young person is asking um, if they're hiring in the central district. So yeah. So for a certain store. Mm -hmm. So you could filter out um, on the website which store you're interested in. But off the top of my head, I know that central district right now is looking for a courtesy clerk um, and clean team member. So that would be like bagging groceries, um, sanitizing, taking out the trash. And that's a position that um, we hire at um, 16. Wonderful, great news that you hire at 16. Yeah, definitely. Um, and then in terms of pay, I, just real quick, um, yes. all Seattle positions also start at 1639. Um, we do take into account um, experience. So if you do have, um, relative experience. Um, the east side um, and outside of Seattle does start at $13.50, um, but we are trying to be competitive and a lot of positions are going to go for $14 or $15 an hour. So that would include Burien? Yes, Burien is outside of the Seattle limits. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But West Seattle um, is in Seattle, so 